Apple fans, bashers, and everyone else in between, we are almost here and we're talking about the new iPhones that will be launched tomorrow. Alvin here from KT's tech team and we're here to give you what to expect on the latest flagship phones from Apple. Just to make it clear, these are not official confirmations. These are just what to expect and everything we've been hearing on the web. All right, let's cut to the chase. Uh, we are expecting a new chip on the new iPhones, specifically the A10 chip with 2.4 gigahertz. That is up from the A9. Going to storage, we are expecting 32, 128, and 256 GB. Repeat, 256 GB. That's double the maximum storage of the iPhone 6S. Going to RAM, we are expecting the 4.7 inch iPhone 7 to be a 2 GB standard issue. However, we are also looking forward to 3 GB of RAM on the 5.5 inch iPhone 7 Plus. Now the cameras, both are expected to have 12 megapixels with optical image stabilization. However, it will come with 4 LED flashlights. The new iPhone 7 devices are also expected to be IPX7 rated, which means it's waterproof. We are expecting that the 3.5mm audio jack will be ditched in favor of, you know, just a lightning port. Going to more features, we are also anticipating that the home button might not be physical this time. It's going to be a touch-sensitive area, but still with a fingerprint scanner. There will be two new colors, dark black and glossy piano black. Now, if you can see this photo, this leaked photo, you also notice that the two white linings on the rear of the iPhone is also gone. Okay, so that's all we know at this moment in time. Again, we repeat, these are not official confirmations. These are all what we know, what is carved around the web, and what we've been hearing. Apple, of course, doesn't comment on rumors and speculation, so we'll find out tomorrow. That'll be 10 a.m. U.S. time, Pacific Daylight Time, I believe. That will be 9 p.m. here in Dubai, so repeat. 9 p.m. tomorrow evening, that's Wednesday. Khalid Times will be providing a blow-by-blow -blow coverage of what's happening in San Francisco. And you can just log on to our Facebook account, follow us on Twitter, and we'll find out which of these are true and not. We'll see you around.